Guys, it's B. Wiley. I have a video for you. I had to write this down because it's called Seven Deadly Sins of Singleness. I literally came up with this list and I want you single ladies to pay attention to this list. All right. Number one, thou shall not be desperate or attention seeking. You know what desperate is. We all have had our lows as single women and we just are so desperate for a man and we're so tired of waiting that we literally reach out and give anybody our attention. And we also know what attention seeking is. It's when we get online and then we show too much boob, we show inappropriate shots of our behinds. Let's not do that. Don't fall for that. Number two, thou shalt not settle for any dude or AKA Mr. Nice Guy. You know how you go out and you're single. Any dude will just roll up. He may have 10 kids, 10 baby mamas, live with his mother, and only work part-time at McDonald's. No shade against McDonald's. However, how can you support 10 kids working at McDonald's? It's not going to work. So you just give him a chance because you're bored and you need somebody to talk to. Don't do this. Also, do not entertain the nice guy. When you're single, you meet a nice guy. However, the chemistry is not there, but you feel bad because he's the nice guy. He can be nice and he can be over there and you need to make room for your man to come through. So leave those kind of guys alone. Number three, thou shalt not try to force a dude to see the potential in yourself. That man know the potential in you when he meets you. He know you're a great woman. He knows you're a great cook. He knows you take great care of your children. He knows that you have great qualities. You're educated, you're wise, you're brilliant, you're funny. He knows all that. So either he wants you or he don't. But you cannot force a dude to see the potential in you if he doesn't recognize it on his own. Number four, thou shalt not give up on men altogether. This is only a sing this is only a sing a season and just because you're single now doesn't mean you're going to be single for a lifetime. Just because the man cheated on you, abandoned you, left you or just because he was a great guy and it just did not work out does not mean you have to give up on men altogether because it doesn't make logical sense that just because something didn't work out that you just have to give up and throw in the towel. It's silly. Number five, thou shall not become a bitter bitch. Girl, do not go out here with your nose turned up mad as hell due to what happened to you. Use the hand that you were dealt and keep it moving. Being bitter, being angry, being mad will definitely not attract the husband that you desire. Number six, thou shall not put all of your eggs in one basket. So when you're single, every dude is not your husband. Every dude is not going to be in your life long term. So get that out of your head. Spread those eggs around because I guarantee when dudes out here dating, they spreading it. They spreading it out to the community. So you need to spread your eggs around as well and just have fun when you're dating until you realize who you want to get serious with. The last one, number seven, thou shall not ever leave the house looking a mess. I hate it. I can't stand y'all ladies coming out here. I can say y'all because it ain't me. Out here with bonnets on your head, looking a hot mess. Pajamas on, raggedy big, raggedy t-shirts. It doesn't, it, it doesn't make any sense. And what you need to do, you don't have to get up and look like you're going to audition for a movie role or a pageant or anything like that. However, it's imperative that you do your hair properly. Whatever you wear, wigs, weave, you wear your natural hair like myself, whatever you do, you get up and you look in the mirror and look presentable and do not be that girl that says, I ain't who I'm trying to impress. Who am I? It's not about impressing anyone else. It's about impressing yourself. You want to look in the mirror and you want to be presentable. Make yourself look good each and every day. It doesn't matter. And that does not mean getting full glam to go down to the dollar store. It means be presentable. You know what that means. So those are my seven deadly sins of singleness. I'm B. Wiley. Let me know your thoughts.